Verizon including double SIM and EFSIM support as delayed that it wouldn't have the capacity to work with the Epony XS, XS Max, and XS with double SIM abilities. Verizon advises representatives it's currently hoping to launch double SIM with any SIM and a physical SIM combined together by beginning of December. Apple at first reported to Verizon, T-Mobile, and AT&T would all help double SIMs. Be that as it may, Verizon users kept running into an obstacle. You can just utilize Verizon's physical SIM card for your essential line. And on the odd chance that you swap it over to your optional line. The services gets downsized to a 2G heritage range rather than LTE. As the network carrier understood the auxiliary line won't have the capacity to help fast information and voice. It held off on offering EFSIM support. Therefore, you can't get full double SIM capacities with Verizon alone, and will require an alternative carrier. Different US carriers likewise feature by comparative issues, proposing that no one in America prepared for double SIM presently. AT&T finished its double SIM support when it found a bug with the Epony Visual Voicemail highlight not taking the shot at telephones with two dynamic lines. It's attempting to determine the issue. T-Mobile has correspondingly said that EFSIM is accessible once the product prepared. The Verizon double SIM and ESM appropriation presently appears limited to early December, while alternate errors are vaguer on when we can expect full double SIM support.